A handful of Republican lawmakers voted against Kevin McCarthy today during his bid for minority leader. Representatives Jim Jordan, Andy Biggs, Thomas Massey, and Pat Fallon were among the most vocal opponents. Jordan expressed his continued dissatisfaction with Republican leadership after his protest vote against McCarthy. He stated that in the future, new voices must be heard if the party is to survive. Biggs came out against McCarthy for his failure to withstand President Donald Trump and his policies. He indicated that McCarthy is too easily influenced by those in power, and not tough enough. Massey also voted against McCarthy, though he did not outline a specific set of grievances. He believes there are better options available that would bring ideological diversity to the top of the party. Pat Fallon also voted against McCarthy, citing a lack of meaningful discourse among members. He argued that McCarthy lacks the capacity to bring the party together in a constructive way. Other members who voted against McCarthy included Representatives Chip Roy, Matt Rosendale, Chip Roy, and Scott DeYarles. Their reasons remain largely unclear, though some voiced concerns about the ideological divide. Following the vote, McCarthy reiterated his commitment to party unity and said he would work hard to bring all Republicans together. He has worked tirelessly since then to build bridges and constructively change the party in a positive way. A few members, such as Senator Rand Paul, have expressed support for McCarthy's bid for minority leader. Paul believes McCarthy represents the future of the party, and he has faith in his abilities. Despite the vocal opposition today, McCarthy ultimately won the majority of the vote. He is the only House Republican in history to lose a bid for minority leader, and he will surely face an uphill battle ahead. Some Republicans have continued to voice their concerns about McCarthy's leadership and ideology. However, many also believe that it is time to unite the party behind one leader and work towards winning in 2020. Others have applauded his courage to stand up against Trump when necessary. They believe McCarthy is a leader who is willing to stand up for conservative values and principle from time to time. People are encouraged by McCarthy's political experience and his ability to effectively communicate with all members. He has a long history of working with both Democrats and Republicans, which many find reassuring. The opposition against McCarthy among some Republican members has highlighted the deep rift within the party.